welcome you back to the 2023 Big West Women's Basketball Preview Show presented by BuyB1.com. I'm Krista Blunt, joined by Tammy Blackburn. And Tammy, we're up to the number four pick on the season, UC San Diego, the Tritons, a team jumping from Division Two to Division One. So they still have to pay a little bit of time off and not be part of postseason. But this is a team that's going to force everybody else in the Big West to compete and to be ready. They have a veteran squad. Yeah, I think, you know, credit to Heidi Vanderveer, who is in her 11th year, and, and I think she has done a remarkable job. It's not easy to make that transition from Division Two to Division One, and well, I just give a lot of credit to the coaching staff and these student athletes, to those who are committed to that transition to compete, to want to play. I think the love of the game and the passion for the game really comes out. Uh, they do make this conference better, and she is very, very excited about what they're going to be able to do in postseason when that time comes. But she breaks down uh, preseason and she says, my focus is to prepare my team through preseason in non-conference and then get ready for Big West competition. She's got four starters, four seniors back from a season ago. And one of those is Sydney Brown. She's now a grad student, but wow, an all Big West second teamer last year and just brings that experience to the, to the group. Yeah, you know, just take a look at some of the breakdown of, of just watch a little film on Sydney Brown and she's that graduate student. She's a guard second team uh, honoree for the Big West. She's a double digit scorer, but she's just so much more than that. And what she brings to the team, uh, a hard worker, a student of the game, a player that wants to get in and watch film. She loves the sport. I think that it shows. And then when you put her next to Julia Makabuhe, uh, that's a huge help. Uh, uh, Julia, also an all Big West honorable mention. Yeah, a lot of versatility on this Tritons team. And for more from that, we'll get a chance to hear from the head coach, Heidi Vanderveer, and she'll break things down for us for the Tritons when we return. The B1 Performance Patch elevates physical functions by transforming carbs into glucose used to fuel the body. Don't compete without it. Visit buyb1.com or on social media at B1 Patch. Power isn't born, it's built over time. For over 65 years, Hercules Tires has been providing the muscle to move more drivers. Whatever the vehicle, whatever the terrain, and we back it with a powerful protection plan. So wherever the road or the trail takes you, we have the selection, value, and strength to get you there. Hercules Tires, ride on our strength. Great seats at a great price. Get them safer, simpler, and smarter with Ticket Smarter. A proud partner to the biggest names in live sports and events, including ESPN Events and iHeartRadio. Ticket Smarter has seats for over 125,000 live events and 48 million tickets for sale. All backed with the Ticket Smarter 100% ticket guarantee. Thinking about your next great live event? Think smarter. Think Ticket Smarter. Get your tickets your way guaranteed at TicketSmarter.com. The Big West is back in Las Vegas. Don't miss the 2023 Hercules Tires Big West Basketball Championships presented by the Hawaiian Islands, March 7th through the 11th at the Dollar Loan Center in Henderson, Nevada. Catch the pulse-pounding action as 20 men's and women's teams battle to punch their ticket to the NCAA Tournament. Get the best seats in the house at UCSDTritons.com slash tickets or call 858-534-1430. Welcome back to the Big West Women's Basketball Preview Show. We're up to our number four pick team in the preseason, and it is the UC San Diego Tritons. Molly Sullivan got a chance to catch up with the head coach, Heidi Vanderveer. Let's listen in. So we got 11th season for you on deck. Uh, what's what's going through your mind here in early October as we get ready to, to tip here for the season? Well, I think it's just uh, recognizing all the progress that we've made through uh, whether it's summer access in the preseason uh, to really tackle a very challenging uh, non-conference schedule in order to be prepared for a, a very challenging uh, Big West Conference play. You've got nine returning players, Coach, uh, including four starters, four seniors, oh, by the way. Uh, give, us, give us some, what are, what are some of the, the things we should watch out for this season with your returning? Well, I think that uh, we're very excited about the, the team that we have and the, 
versatility we have. And obviously you made reference to the experience with uh, not only four seniors, but uh, a six year senior in Emily Cangelosi, who uh, has been really the heart and soul of our team uh, with Julia Macabuhe, who has been just a, an energizer. Uh, you know, I'm a, energizer bunny might sound funny, but uh, just the, again, just sets the tone for our team. Uh, Madison Baxter and her stability and uh, really excited to have Sid Brown for her uh, fourth year, um, which is her fifth year in graduate school uh, to give us great uh, stability. I think they've uh, understand the big West conference after playing in it for two years and uh, can really maybe transition some of our younger kids, our younger players uh, to uh, let them understand how you have to be prepared every game because there are extremely talented players in the big West uh, extremely well coached teams and uh, be ready for, for big West battles. So I, I like the makeup in terms of uh, class wise of our team and also uh, the versatility that we have. Hey, listen, energi energizer bunny is anything but funny. Uh, you know, it's pretty dangerous. I almost butchered that, that joke there. There's a reason why for that coach. We're all in mid season yes. form here. Uh, you also scooped up the Colorado sportswoman of the year on uh, a division two transfer. Yes. Quite talented, very promising, uh, both on and off the floor for you. Yeah, uh, Denali Pinto is uh, from the Colorado School of Mines. She was a three-time All-American there, uh, has come in and, again, given us a little bit more experience. I feel like um, when you transition, as we have, to, to the Big West, I think that uh, obviously talent, you have to be very talented, um, but uh, there is no uh, substitute for experience. And I feel like she gives us uh, some maturity, some vers – again, I go back to the word, which is my favorite word, is versatility for players um, – you know, she can shoot. She's big enough to post up. She can maybe guard multiple positions and play multiple positions and uh, has come in and really established herself as, as a very hard worker and uh, really fits in very well with the core of our team. When you really zoom in on your four freshman coach, how will you look for them to step up and make immediate uh, contributions to everything that you want to accomplish both on and off the floor? Well, I think, again, we talked about experience being maybe one of the key factors in success and as well as talent, and they are very talented while they lack an experience. I feel like um, the other kind of component of a championship team and or even to be competitive in, in a conference as the Big West is to have competitive depth. And I feel like uh, the four uh, incoming freshmen that we have definitely add to our competitive depth. They are talented, uh, and I think they'll – uh, hopefully contribute uh, both on the court, but also grow um, and, and be able to, uh, you know, give us that, that competitive depth that, um, you know, barring injury, foul trouble, you know, things that happen in the course of a year uh, allow us to uh, continue to improve every day, which is, is our primary goal as, as our program is to uh, have individual improvement every day. What would you say, Coach, to those, and of course the preview shows, that's the beautiful thing about these, right? Everything's on paper. But what do you say to those that say perhaps that, that size could be an issue, uh, mm -hmm. depth could be an issue without size inside? Where, where does your team go with, with, a, with a challenge like that without much depth inside? Yeah, I think that we, um, obviously it's, it's no, no, no secret. I mean, we, uh, I think Bridget Mullings, though, quite honestly, is, is a, could be an impact post player. I think uh, Katie Springs gives us a good athleticism and good, uh, you know, a, a very aggressive rebounder. And um, I think that I, I go back to my favorite word, which is versatility. Um, we're, we know we're going to have to, well, whether it's double inside or, you know, kind of do maybe be more conscientious in terms of defensive rebounding. I feel like uh, we can put five people out there that, uh, you know, can shoot the ball very well and you're going to have to guard us all over the floor. And um, sometimes, uh you know, somebody's greatest strengths are also their greatest weaknesses. So if we're talking about our weakness in terms of uh, physical uh, size, I also think that sometimes that might be one of our, our greatest strengths. Speaking of versatility and the complete package, Sydney Brown, yeah, uh, the 2022 Big West Service and Leadership Award recipient and everything that she does uh, to lead by example and, and really everything that she's made of, uh, how do you best put into words what she means to your program? Well, I think Sid is the epitome of somebody who is very resilient, obviously um, somebody who's transferred into our program from Columbia, uh, from New York, but, you know, obviously we're in the big West and, and not a lot of maybe New Yorkers, so to speak. I'm from New York, so I can attest to that different, different culturally. Um, Sid is, is a hard worker. 
Uh, she is very competitive and she loves to play. And I think that, um, again, I think her, when you say one attribute, it's really hard to just pinpoint one. Um, but I would, I, I would attest to, to Sid's uh, resiliency as her, her business, biggest strength. And it serves our team well, um, obviously on the court and then in practice and then uh, just in her daily life. She's, she's a winner, worker, winner, and uh, extremely resilient young woman. Thank you so much for your time, Coach. We're looking forward to the road ahead. We're coming to you from Henderson, Nevada, a couple minutes mm -hmm. away from Dollar Loan Center, by the way. Uh, yeah. Where everything uh, will go up. You know, yeah. we're, we're excited. I know we can't play there this year, but we're, we're very excited to, to hopefully play there in the future. Right. As are we. Thank you, you so much, ready. Coach. Best of luck this season. Uh, thanks, Molly. Ha have a, a great rest of your day, and good luck to all the other uh, teams in the Big West for a, a wonderful year and representing a great conference. Thank you, Coach. Thank you. Big West is back in Las Vegas. Order your tickets today for the 2023 Hercules Tires Big West Basketball Championships presented by the Hawaiian Islands, March 7th through the 11th at the Dollar Loan Center in Henderson, Nevada. Don't miss a minute of pulse pounding action as 20 men's and women's teams battle to punch their ticket to the next level. Get the best seats in the house at ucsdtritons.com slash tickets, or you can call 858-534-1430. The B1 Performance Patch elevates physical functions by transforming carbs into glucose used to fuel the body. Don't compete without it. Visit buyb1.com or on social media at B1 Patch. Malama is to cherish and protect the reefs, the fish, the birds, the winds, and the land. Ah. Giving back, that's something that lasts generations. Learn how you can Malama Hawaii at gohawaii.com slash malama. Sometimes faster isn't always better. Like when you're getting a tattoo. Or saying I love you on the first date. Or putting together certain Swedish furniture. But when it comes to getting in and out of the airport, faster is always better. And at Ontario International Airport, you can have the stress-free experience from the curb to the gate. It's the least we can do. Big West is back in Las Vegas. Don't miss the 2023 Hercules Tires Big West Basketball Championships presented by the Hawaiian Islands, March 7th through the 11th at the Dollar Loan Center in Henderson, Nevada. Catch the pulse pounding action as 20 men's and women's teams battle to punch their ticket to the NCAA tournament. Get the best seats in the house at ucsdtritons.com slash tickets or call 858-534-1430. So Tammy Heidi Vanderbeer has a veteran group back, but her team has a couple of new pieces to go along with that as well. And she talked about versatility. That's so key for her. They don't have the size that maybe some of the other teams do. They're going to have to really be creative and use some of that versatility. Well, when you listen to that interview, you just, first of all, how could you not love just sitting down and talking basketball with Heidi Vanderveer and, and listening to her? You know, I have a lot of good takeaways and, and I learn a lot when listening to her. Uh, she's absolutely right that you really can't teach experience. There just is no substitute. And I think her brilliant mind for the game and her experience and where she comes from and, and how she puts it all together is just to be admired because she is she can coach and she can say everything she can to her players, but it's the players that need to be able to step out on the floor and lead the younger students uh, and the student athletes that you're talking about, Krista. And that's what she's gonna do. She's all about empowering her team. And, uh, and I just think Heidi Vanderveer, one of the best coaches uh, around, and, and of course, a great pedigree too. Uh, really can't wait to see what she can do, and especially can't wait to see them in postseason in no time. I agree. Again, not eligible this year, not eligible for another year because of the reclassification between uh, Division Two to Division One. but they are going to cause some problems in the regular season, no doubt about it. Well, don't go anywhere. More to go over for you, our number three pick on the preseason poll when we return right here on the preview show.